Hey little muffins, it's Cassie. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really appreciate it. So, I am coming in today just to do like a quick video. Um, I've gotten a lot of questions from like my Instagram and email and stuff like that. Talking about like my weight loss journey and everything like that. So I'm just going to come in and do like a quick video just to inform you guys on some things. With my weight loss journey, I wasn't going to come on here and be like, I'm doing this, I'm doing that, and blah, 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 because I've done it numerous times and I've fallen off. Um, I feel like I'm going to, I feel like I can keep myself more accountable if I just do it myself um, and not have everybody in my way in my business. Even though I do post on Instagram, but coming in doing videos and everything like that about it, I think at this time in the journey, it's a little bit too early, but, um, you know, I'm doing it. And I'm doing it by myself, and because usually I would have somebody like, um, some like you know, I, I had my ex boyfriend or whatever, and we would live together. We did our weight loss journey together, and I just had other people around me and everything like that to push me. But now, um, you know, eating by myself, um, you know, and everything like that. So it's like I make my own meals. I do everything. I go grocery shopping. I do everything by myself. So it keeps me a little bit more accountable, which I think helps me in the long run. Um, so what I have been doing is just exercising, eating right. When I first started, I was kind of doing a calorie count. But with calorie counting, that's why I just didn't like it is because I'm stuck to just that calorie intake. And I was so I would be so like worried about Ooh, I can't eat that because it has so many calories or whoop de woo whatever. But now I'm just like, you know what, I'm going to eat what I want but healthy. Um, portion, I, I do portion control. Uh, majority of things that I eat will be like a cup of something. So if I'm eating like I'll have like a cup of brown rice or I have a cup of like um, last night for dinner, I made brown rice and beef and broccoli which was delicious, and I'm actually going to have the rest of that for my lunch today when I go to work, um, during my lunch, and then for dinner tonight, I'm just going to have chicken salad when I get home. So, I mean, I'm watching what I'm eating. I'm eating all fresh things, all greens, everything like that. I'm back on my smoothies, I'm doing my smoothies. I'm actually, I have one right now. This is my breakfast smoothie. Um, what's in here is, um, a hand, two handfuls of spinach, a whole apple, um, like a berry mixture, um, no, I think that's it, yeah, and a banana, a half a banana, half a frozen banana so you can get it, you know, nice and smoothie-like. So, um, that's my breakfast. Um, this cup, which I absolutely love, I got this from Target, and I think it was $10. It came with a purple straw, but I got a set of straws, and the straws were like $5. Um, just because, you know, straws can get mold in them and everything like that, sometimes it's hard to clean them, so I just, like, use the straw for, like, a week, and then I'll throw it away, you know, after I clean it and stuff. But... Yeah, so this is the cup. I love it. It keeps my smoothies like a good temperature. It doesn't sweat because it's double layer. And it's just like a um, mason jar. And I think it's 20 fluid ounces if I'm not mistaken. But I love it. Also, I bought myself a Polar watch. A Polar FT4 watch. I'll post a picture of it. I forgot to bring it in my recording space. So, um, I bought one. I got mine off Amazon for $65, I believe, which is a good price because if you go to Target, Walmart, wherever they sell them, they're usually $100. So I got it. I love my Polar Watch. It keeps me motivated. If you're not following me on Instagram, follow me because that's where I post everything. Um, to keep myself accountable, I'm posting my dinners and lunch on there. Breakfast not so much because breakfast is usually a smoothie or I'll just make some eggs or something real quick and light because in the morning I really don't want to be cooking and doing all this stuff like that. So I post my lunch and my dinner usually on Instagram just to keep myself motivated and to just show you guys what I'm eating. So as you guys know, I love my water. This right here is my water bottle, a.k.a. Mr. Blue, Big Blue, or The Bag. Either way. So the bottle is 74.4 ounces. I drink two of these a day. So, um, like right now, I didn't drink all my water last night. I drank half, as you can see. Um, so what I'm going to do is just put this back in the refrigerator and drink the rest of it. Well, fill it back up and then drink the rest um, when I get home from work. So, yeah, I drink my water. I eat healthy. Um, I don't, I'm not really a snacker. I'm not too much of, like, an eater. Like, that's what's so difficult for me. Because I'll eat, like, one meal a day and I'll be good to go. Um, 
it's always been like that so but now I'm back on my weight loss and everything I have to eat so I'm trying to eat um I work out I try to get like an hour and 30 minutes of exercise in on a daily um Sunday is usually gonna well Sunday is my rest day this week um I worked out every day besides one and today Saturday so that's good for me um I'll go to the gym I'll go outside and walk or I'll just do a walk walk a mile um dvd here at the house or um hip hop abs whatever I feel like doing I like to switch up my workout especially if I'm working at home because it gets boring if you do the same tape over and over again so yeah switch it up also I'm corset training I'm still in my corset game I post a picture somewhere in this video so you guys can see um my waist has came in dramatically I have no more love handles and that's from exercising, eating right, corset training. That's not just from straight corset training. Um, after I started picking back up my eating habits, um, eating good stuff, eating more than once a day, my weight started to come in even more with the waist training. So I'm excited about that. I don't have my corset on right now um, because I'm about to go to work. And um, I was going to wear it today, but I don't know if I have to do like a lot of movement today at work. I don't know if it's going to be a steady day or a slow day. I don't know. So just trying to keep it chill today with without wearing the corset. Um, but yeah, y'all, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm trying to lose 10 inches. Um, I'm trying. I've already lost 5. Trying to lose 10 more and make it 15. So, um, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying. And I work out and I eat. And it just came down to a point where I was like, Cassie, you have to do it. Like, why won't you do it? It's not like I can't do it. It's not like I don't know how to do it. It's just I don't do it. So, yeah, y'all, let me get off this camera because my camera is actually blinking. So, that's it. If you guys have any questions, email me, Instagram me, comment on Instagram, DM me, whatever you guys can get to me, do that. For some reason, YouTube is not allowing me to reply back to comments as frequently as I used to for some reason. I can probably get one or two comments in and then it gets, like, flagged. So, I don't know what's going on with that. So, it's not that I'm ignoring you guys or anything like that. It's just, for some reason... YouTube is not allowing me to comment back. So, um, I will see you guys in my next video. And I love you guys so much. And thank you so much for sticking with your girl. Because I love y'all. Bye, loves.